Hi guys, this is Apple Expert here. Uh, we uh, we specialize in Mac repairs, including logic boards, uh, data recovery uh, from Macs uh, with the T uh, like with the T1 chip, T2 chip. Uh, uh, we also uh, specialize in data recovery from hard drives. Uh, today uh, we received the interesting uh, uh, case here: uh, A1707 laptop, 10 inch, uh, board number uh, 8200814. Uh, the customer brought it in uh, with us for data recovery and it was at Apple Store. Uh, Apple Store told them it's a logic board issue and uh, obviously uh, since uh, the hard drive is part of the logic board so data is not possible unless uh, fixing the motherboard partially or fully uh, then uh, the customer was given uh, a business card uh, for a data recovery in uh, California uh, then he went to another store uh, like locally in Calgary and they told him it is not possible and when we got the laptop uh, we noticed that the logic board no one took it apart even uh, they just uh, tried to put to uh, uh, like pour on the laptop then it did not work uh, there was no port dead so they told him that okay is not possible and you have to replace the motherboard I want to show you exactly uh, what's uh, what's 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 doing uh, can you check me the voltage here just uh, grab me a picture of the voltage so i post it on the on the on the screen ready for me okay so i'm going to uh, inject the 20 volt here so here So it's stuck at uh, 19 volt with no current to draw. So there is obviously uh, an issue here. Uh, from here, uh, like like from this uh, voltage and the current that stuck at uh, uh, 0.066, I know for a fact that USB-C controllers is communicating with the with the portable, telling him, "Hey, I'm a MacBook. I need a 20 volt." So the problem is not with the USB-C controller, which has been told by other store or the power chips, so I decided to uh, uh, let's go and investigate under microscope. So as you see, no problem, no problem, no problem, no issue, no issue, no issue no issue so what i will do i will uh, check for uh, shortage on main power lines to see if uh, if, if we have uh, some short there is a short here immediately i see a short here uh, actually it's not a short then okay okay cpu no issue gpu no short that does not mean they are good uh, shorts i can we can solve them easily like the very easiest to uh, repair here uh, are shorts logic board so this 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 side of the logic board has no problem i'll check the other side uh oh 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 you see this guys so there is physically a, a burnt capacitor crack on the motherboard i'll come back to this later then so i don't see any other problem you see here if we if we if we check this schematic uh, let's see what is this uh, so this is basically it is c7660 it's uh, 33 microfarad okay 
materials and this and this. So this is 33 microfarad, that crack, and this is uh, the 5 volt, 3.3 volt uh, power supply circuit. So basically, this is one of the com one of the uh, one of the capacitors that's connected to U7660, uh, responsible for the uh, the S5 state and S0 state, uh, specifically the 3.3 volt. So let's let's remove this capacitor and see how things goes. I mean, it is really sad when there is a conflict of interest between the customer uh, and when he go to a store, and that store either is not in his interest to repair the laptop because either he doesn't know how to repair it or uh, his interest is to sell the customer another laptop so always whatever you go is not true that what they tell you is the truth uh, now we happen customers like we happen to get customers here after they go to other stores uh, they come to us for that recovery and we found that 99% of the cases uh, uh, the customer was told it's 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 a motherboard issue sometimes it is not even because it doesn't turn on uh, sometimes just the battery really in, in a bad shape all what you have to do unplug the battery and plug it again and that's uh, because they don't care they are not interested or wrong diagnostic uh, or he go to another store and he's try to uh, uh, do a trial and error with him. Here at Apple Expert, we do diagnosis on the spot for free. Uh, we don't charge people for it. And even if the customer wants, we do repairs right in front of the motherboard repairs. Uh, because everything is repairable if you know what you're doing. I'll just remove this capacitor as well. So I decided to do this uh, video because I really feel sorry for this customer that he went to the biggest store and they told him it's not repairable. Then they send him, they, they ask him to ship it to, advise him to ship it to USA for battery recovery. Uh, then he went to another local store that he claims he can do repairs, blah, 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 and he does data recovery. And uh, like he told me data is not possible, but he, he will be, he might be able to, uh, to, to fix it. And the customer approached us and immediately, uh, as you see, it's, uh, it's really a uh, very short repair, doesn't take time. Uh, and the customer was mis uh, uh, misled by the, by, 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 by the other stores uh, to uh, send it somewhere else or, uh, uh, to forget about his data uh, everything is repairable again if it was a Mac, iPhone, iPad uh, data is recoverable from them uh, or a hard drive, external hard drive or even uh, Windows, Windows laptop any medium that has data we can recover them uh, our technicians here uh, professional electronic engineers Apple certified and uh, forensic data recovery certified uh, if whatever you would like guys if anyone in Calgary and want to see the store he's welcome to come we we'll walk him through what we do every day and uh, you can if anyone tell you device is not repairable come here we will help you uh, we give a year warranty on our repairs I'm just add a little bit of flux I'll grab a flux here By the way, this is based on experience most of the time. When we see this bad, uh, we notice that uh, after the repair, uh, we do many of those after the repair, we notice that uh, the battery is bad showing service. 
I don't know if it's related or not, but I believe so. I did not have a single case where it has this issue. And after that, battery has no problem. Uh, so this, uh, maybe the, uh, the customer is, uh, we, we, uh, uh, he, uh, we have to change him the battery. Anyway, this board has to go through ultrasonic, has to be clean. I just wanted to check uh, uh, to see if that did the repair. I will check for a short now. I use my electronic signature. I don't use a voltmeter uh, because those all of them low, uh, low, low frequency circuits. Uh, can someone help me here just to sure. measure, uh, with the camera? Point to the voltage here. Uh, three volts, 1.2 volts. So I can guarantee you it is repaired. I'll show you here on the on the screen. Can you help me, bro? So can you just shoot the entire thing? me to show me the if it, if it just the upper logo appears or not point one one point stopping down it is hot because I just did the capacitor replacement. Yeah, up a logo, I'll hide the customer. Okay, so we got the data on the motherboard, the, the logic code, the laptop is fixed. So uh, as you see guys here, I wanted to uh, make a video about this laptop. So that was the only problem with the laptop. The motherboard was not taken out by Apple store or any other stores. And it was reported to the customer that uh, a logic board issue. And if he cared about the data, he, should, he uh, like he should send it to to ESA for data recovery. That would cost him three thousand dollar minimum. And then they took it to uh, to other store and they told him it's not uh, it's not uh, like it's not repairable. And the funny thing, when we received the laptop and we get this all all the time, no one took a board, took out the, the board. How how we know? Uh, the screws, all of them were virgin, uh, no screwdriver went in there, and the uh, customer doesn't know better. So, uh, uh, bottom line, uh, if you've been told that your data is not recoverable, uh, or uh, your iPhone is not recoverable, or you have a problem with the phone, uh, or your, your uh, laptop or your uh, hard drive, uh, then come check us out. We do it on the spot for free. Uh, we have all kind of certificates, we are certified. Uh, now, uh, uh, one of the things that we get a lot, uh, iPhones uh, specifically, they stuck on Apple logo. They go to other stores or the biggest stores and uh, uh, they try software uh, uh, ways to solve them. And most of the time it's not a software. They tell the customer, oh, sorry, uh, we cannot do it. And when they bring it to us, we take it apart and uh, like through a little bit of diagnosis we we find that she was a hardware on the motherboard which is fixable then we ended up fixing the motherboard and uh, uh, the phone will work but we, we we discovered that it was erased by the wrong by, by, by the previous store through a wrong diagnosis uh, so you do your homework do your research to who you bring your iPhones or your iPad or your MacBook or your external hardware for data recovery and come see us we walk you we do it right in front of you uh, uh, here at Apple Expert we are located uh, at 1504 14th Street uh, southwest in Calgary we work uh, weekdays uh, 11 to 8 Saturday 11 to 7 see you in another video thank you guys